in time, the only Friday night 30 minute show in Northeast Wisconsin dedicated to high school football. Well, if you throw in that NFL team from Chicago, you'll have Dorothy herself saying, oh my, it's Lions and Tigers squaring off tonight in our game of the week. The Lions, the longtime kings of the conference, but they have a contender tonight. They squared off in our game time game of the week, and that would be the eighth ranked team in our Fox 11 top 11. Chilton, they bring the Tigers to the Lions and Tigers equation. Brilliant, never easy to beat at home. Might be underdogs, but they're still tough. Elliot Piepenberg always knows how to run the ball in that Pete Kittle-led attack. That made it 7-0. Could they spring the upset? Chilton, they love to run it as well. Lucas Forstner, prep expert Doug Ritchie told me before this game, these teams had combined for 33 passes. So what happens when you try to pass? Well, Isaac Nadler for Brilliant comes up with the sack, but Chilton, that running attack is tough to stop. Jared Wagner going around the left side, waiting patiently, finds his way inside the pylon to take the lead. Later on, it would be Wagner again, this time going around the right side, showing some bursts, getting in for the score. And that would be the last touchdown of the game. Chilton wins it 21 to seven. Prep expert Doug Ritchie caught up with head coach Ray Malata. When you play brilliant, you have to deal with the wing T offense. And uh, nobody teaches it better than Coach Kittle. And then they sprinkle in some of the Army formation things and the jet sweep stuff. Um, so they're really an efficient offense. I know they've only scored 12 points a game or whatever, but they move the ball. Um, and so they always scare you that way. You know, this was, this was a big game for both teams. I give them a lot of credit. Um, and our kids, uh, we didn't take good care of the ball. Um, ball security was an issue. We haven't had problems with that all year. Um, and we're very fortunate, actually, to overcome those mistakes and still get out of here with a win. Anybody's fortunate to get a win.